So today I'm back fishing for the carp, um, but first I'm going to show you a quick clip I fair last year, showing you how I set up the gear, how I set up uh, my method feeder, and show you how I set up my ground bit. So in my ground bit, it's just going to be four mil size pellets, and the ground bit I'm going to be using is this method mix. Just give it a good mix together. Liquid, I'm going to be using this liquid carp uh, food um, just for extra scent and flavour. And just give it a good mix together. Once you've added that, just add a wee small amount of water. And if you need to add more, just add it as you go along. You keep mixing it till you get it into it, almost a paste. And then you leave it about 10 20 minutes just to let it absorb all the water and the flavour into the ground bait and the pellets. So while I'm waiting on the ground bait to set, as you can see, I've got my unhooking mat there. I've also got a bucket of water so I can keep the unhooking mat wet for when I'm going to unhook the fish and stuff like that. So as you can see I've got my large landing net as well as my small one, so I've got them all set up ready. So now it's just a case of beating up the rods and start fishing. So as for my rod, just let you see that, it's a 10 foot 3 pound test cuff, size 60 bait runner, with 30 pound mono down to 15 pound floor carbon and it's connected with a double uni nut. Down at the business end, it's a 30 gram through line method feeder, down to a quick change speed and then it's a 4 inch hair rig, um, size 12 barbless hook. The uh, bait I'm going to be using on the hair rig is this what I always use, which is sweet corn. It's worked in the past so hopefully it works today. Now that the method feeder is all set up and the bait is all ready, it's just a case of waiting for a fish. So I was down the other day there um, with my uncle William, my cousin Lewis and my pal Aldo and we had a good day's fishing so here's how we got on. Oh, that's a decent one, too. Nice. Lewis with his first cup. That, that shite throw came in good, didn't it? No, that was a better throw. That was the one in the middle, again. That's the second one for the so, middle. So, middle is where they're, they're sitting at the moment, in the deeper part. That's a cup. That's maybe a. It's maybe my first cap. Nope, oh, there's no. There's my first cap, it's just got fucking hard. Margot William, his first cap. Ring in general. Just right in the edge of slap, I'm gonna. Try not to let it see. Oh! Uncle William with his second cup. Right. So it's, it's seen that now, it's just went for it. So what it does, and bring it in this time, I'll try and hit it. Oh, it's going to, it's going to, it's going to, it's going to, it's going to try and bring it this way. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so me and my cousin Lewis this had a double hook up there. Can I beat it? I know it was a decent one because it was coming in too easy. As I'm saying, I've just literally seen that sometimes the bigger one goes along with it. No, that's a decent size for here. I'll go William with his third fish. Mm, Try to make it go to the right. 
Worst way to stop the cop. Keep real, keep real. Worst way's first mirror and fourth cup over there. So today I'm back down fishing for the cup, so I just need to hope that it's a good day and just try. Um, but it's a nice sunny day today, so hopefully the cup are on the feed and start catching. But tight lines. Thanks for watching. First week up a day, we crushing cut. Second week up a day. I forgot to record on the GoPro, too busy trying to land the fish. <laughs> that I forgot to record that. But this is the second cup of the day. Hopefully, it's start getting bigger. Can you get an egg, please? Yeah. Yeah. Last second fish of the day, another week of the carp. And also, that's the third fish of the day. So, hopefully, it's. Hopefully, we get more of them. But as you can see, they're starting to be fish. This is the one you caught quick. This rail, this rail, this rail. Let if it wants if it wants to run, let it run. Keep, keep your rod up. Is it still on? Bite me though. That's alright, just let it, just let it. It's gonna right, you, you if I go to the left you go to the right. Fourth common carp of the day. Still small, but hopefully it'll start getting a wee bit bigger later on as the day goes on. But nah, still a nice still a nice fish. I'll, it's best get this one back now, I think. There it goes. Oh, that's alright. Let, uh, let it run if it wants to run. I'll keep rolling. Oh! Get Ow! I get half. Wait, wait, wait. wait. So fifth week carp of the day, they're still small but I still love catching carp so it doesn't matter the size to be honest so I'm still happy but as you can see it's a nice wee common again. So that's the fifth carp, I'm just letting it recover just before I let it go again. So this is the sixth carp for the day, <laughs> they're all about the same size but I'm hoping as the day goes on we start getting bigger ones. But saying that, I don't care. I'm still happy catching them. Still cracking fish to catch. I want to swam by it. Can I take the time? Little rod up, remember? Oh, that's a good one. Oh, don't know this one. So, number seven of the day, still roughly about the same size, but I think this one's the biggest one of the day. Yeah, still nice to catch. <laughs> nice to be common. So, <laughs> number eight for the day, once again, another small common cup. But still early. Hopefully, hopefully the bigger ones start coming in soon. So they're slightly getting bigger. Uh, number nine for the day. Another common cup. But they're slightly getting bigger, so hopefully in the next three hours uh, they start getting bigger. But no, nah. nine fish, 
I'm, I'm over the moon. Definitely recording this time. Right, I'll net this one because it's going to cross your line. So, number 10. I've reached my target I was aiming for. I thought, try and get 10 today. So I'm actually got 10. <laughs> Unfortunately, I just wee. But like I said, hopefully a big one start coming in. But it's still belters. So, 10 fish of the day. Now we common. Oh, another one. That one's coming in a wee bit too easy. It's not seen in that yet. It's not seen me yet. Another small one for today, but I'm not complaining, it's been a brilliant day so far. Still got a couple more hours to go, so hopefully I'll keep the catching. Oh, this feels a bit, a bit better. Hey. Oh no, that's bigger. <laughs> so this is definitely the biggest one of the day. Still small, but the biggest one of the day so far. So as I keep saying, hopefully that's them now starting to get bigger. But they're definitely switching on the feed now. Um, they're, they're getting a lot more bikes quicker. And also catching a lot quicker now. So they're definitely switching on the feed now that it's getting into later in later on in the afternoon. So Definitely get that. I'm going to try and keep this away for yours. Not that heavy. I'm going to go. I'm going to have a, a guess. I'll say it's another common. So it's still small in some people's eyes, but. It's the biggest one of the day so far. Not so much in length, but as a wee, wee chubby thing. <laughs> but no, I'm quite happy. They're definitely starting to switch on now, like I said, and slightly starting to get bigger. So, got about an hour, maybe an hour and a half left. So, hopefully, <laughs> start catching more. But I'm going to put this one back. So, just as the sun's gone down, I get number 14 for the day. So, that's ever so slightly getting back up, <laughs> not much. But hey, regardless, I'm over the moon, that's 14 fish for the day. So, as you can see, even the small ones are still stunning fish, so I'm well happy. So, it's been a brilliant few trips so far. 14 today, um, best part of spending time with family. Spend time with my uncle and my cousin, spend time with my girlfriend and also my pal Aldo. It's been hard going at times, but today I caught 14. Um, the last trip I caught about 8, I think. I need to look back when I edit this video. But I hope you've enjoyed it. It's been quite a lot of small cup, I get that, but it's still it's fishing. I still really enjoyed it, it's been brilliant. Next time, next episode, this is episode 1, so episode 2, I'm going to try somewhere else. I'm going to try different ways of fishing for cup. That's all upcoming videos. But I hope you've enjoyed this video so far. Till next time, tight lines, thanks for watching.